So, this is technically my first time playing. I just completed the tutorial, you can see in my previous video. And uh, now we have these three AI workers doing their stuff. And our job is to get money, so... Um, I think we just drive to this machine, I don't know how it's called, and just getting the grain from it. And I wonder what's the next thing, because there's still stuff lying here, so maybe make hay bales, I don't know. So, ah, stop. Let's just stop here. Please give me the stuff. No. Why does it not give me the... Oh, there's birds in this game. Damn. So as you can see, I have no idea. Please give me the thing. Do I have to do it by hand? I thought I, I hired an AI worker to do it. Um, turn harvester pipe out. Let's go a bit back. Uh, okay, it turns on automatically. Okay. I'm emptying my thing now. Can it overflow on the other side? Maybe we check. So this is at 50% and... Will we see it? I don't know. It looks full, but we don't have much left, so... We just leave it. And then I have no idea what the next step is here. But like, okay, let's pipe in. Um, and... Disables draw source. Lower header, change cruise control, I don't know. So let's just park this on the side. Is this over here also my field? How can I check? I think I can change or uh, check on the map. How do I know if this is my field? This says something about the status. Soil composition, hotspots, crop type. How do I know which is mine? Farmland, pan up, zoom map, maple. How to tell? I really... Ah, maybe like this. The blue ones. Okay, the blue ones. So I don't own it. But some next things have to be done here. But let's first send this off to be sold. Okay. Do I have any other... So this worker is doing stuff, this is doing stuff, and I have this vehicle, so the only thing I can do is just drive to sell this. And then hope to figure out what to do next here in this field, because I don't know. But there is one other machine over here. What does this machine do? Looks like watering, maybe. Uh, I just had to do this trip in the tutorial. So I think I know... Ah, don't crash. I think I know how to do it. I will fast forward it and then we will figure out what to do with the other field. Okay, so we're at the place. I think I just have to drive over this hatch, like we did in the tutorial. And then press I. And then just wait. This is kind of weird. It's just, you just wait. Ah, but now there's even an animation. And I can see that it's emptying. Nice. Just going in the floor. Okay. It's good. In the meantime, we can check out so what to do with the, with the field. I think there were some tutorials somewhere. Ah, 
Okay, help. Mm. I want to crop. No, I want help with farming basics. So we harvest it. But now I think we just harvest this grain. So now we should be able to do like the bales. But how to do that? Maybe we can do it with the tool at the back. What happens if I press H now? Can I like let him drive somewhere? I don't know. So let's get to the, this machine. We will drop this. I can turn on harvester with B. No header attached. So I don't know what to do. These guys are still working. How about... Come on, twice. What stuff do we have here? There's one more thing. But this looks like... Trailer? How is this a trailer? So you need... You can put something on it, okay. But how to continue with uh, with this field? What is this? This is silo. Is this the case? Okay. Um, then let's drive our thing back and figure out what to do with the land. I mean, we can plow it and put new stuff on it, but I'm not sure if that's what you're supposed to do with it. Let's just drive through to some random field. In total we made, I think, like 9k on this one field. But, but I never had to sow it, so... I'm not sure what this actually means, how much we made. Don't even know what I exactly sold. Just some stuff. No idea. Is this my exit? I need to learn the map. Yes, this is where I have to go. Then let's go there. I mean, I can open an AI worker, but... Like, if I look in the, in the menu, this field is pink, so it's harvested. And once it's harvested, can I buy stuff here or do I really have to drive to the dealer? I don't want to always have to drive to the dealer. Okay, then I will take my car probably in a second and drive to the dealer and see if I can buy... Oh, but I need to take my car now because I don't... Maybe I have to pick it up with a tractor. So I'm looking for a device that can make hay bales from the stuff that is on my field. But I don't know how this would work. I think the dealer is somewhere back here. But I'm not... Ah, it's here. It's here. Wrong turn. Uh, I learned that these cars have like a durability percentage. I'm not sure if it decreases. So can I just drive random? So. Open the shop menu. R. So. I want the tool. 
I want a... Let's see if anything matches. Cedars, Panthers, Raw, Sprayers, Slurry, Meters. Meters? Could be... No, probably not. Bailers. I think this is what I want. Should I try it? But then how do I load the bales? I have no idea. So let's just plow it and plan something new. Okay, that's the game plan now. So... This guy is seeding. I feel like he's doing it slow, but okay. So I just take this now. This was plowed. And I just drive it to the other field and just plow it. No idea if this is the correct thing to do, but... Because it looks like there's still stuff on it. But... Oh well. Then let's just lower it. And... How to start it? Huh, oh, I don't have to start it. So I can hire an AI worker. He will do the job. Maybe this is a big waste, maybe not. We will never know. He's still seeding. Okay, so the plowed field probably should now be seeded. But for that I need the other guy to be finished. But the other guy is still working. So what can I do? Let's explore the house until this other guy is finished, maybe. And let's... this is a water tank, okay. That makes sense. Let's see what the house has to offer. Uh, can I... How to access this open help menu R? Let's see if there's again something. Removing weeds, snow, stone picking, rolling. Animals we don't need. So it's something about... Fertilizer. Tractor I have. Cultivator. Seeding machine. Fertilizer. Harvester. Okay. Let's check out the house. How to do it. How can I get inside? This is my house, no? I thought so, because it's on my land. I have a chainsaw. Can I cut my own trees? No. Somehow I can't cut my trees. Very sad. Very sad about it. Open wardrobe. No, I don't want to change clothes. Let me get inside. Sleep? No, I don't want to sleep. I want my worker to be finished. I want my fin worker to be finished working. So, these are still doing their stuff. Well, then maybe we do want to sleep. For like a few hours. And then hope the worker is finished sleep. What time do you want to wake up? Um, okay, so I have to sleep until the next day. Ah, that's a pain. So let's wake up at 6. Sleep. Let's see what happens. Imagine this is the first sleep of this guy. He never slept before. Interestingly, it's taking a while. Oh my god, it's, it's dark now and I have to pay maintenance on something. Okay. Oh, this it's way too early. Uh, let's speed up the game speed. Because I don't want it dark. I just don't. Let's have it let's do sunrise fast. Oh, but they didn't... Why is he not done yet? 
I slept and this guy still isn't done. What a pain. So sleeping doesn't actually make them work faster. What is this? This is a pain. Okay. Okay. I see how you're doing. So then let's check out more stuff from the help menu. AI worker. Work in a farm. You can hire workers to help you. Activate worker. So I can, can I do this from here? Can I just like tell some guy to do something? Set destination, create job. I want to create a job. Load and deliver, deliver. Go to, load and deliver, okay. What can this machine do? Field work, go to, field work. Field work means harvesting, I guess. So, yeah, I'm not sure what there is to do. Honestly, this is interesting that I don't know what to do. So, finally, this guy completed uh, sowing the field. So now he can start doing the next field. I hope. Uh, that this is how it works otherwise I really have no idea because I just waited for a long time on this and a lot of stuff kind of grew on here but oh well so I want to change the seed and the thing I need to plant I can figure out here somewhere okay so I can I can plant canola. So let's actually then continue doing that. This is canola. Uh, I want to lower cedar. I want to turn on cedar. So this is now seeding. Oh, and it's removing the other stuff. That's good. And then hire the worker. And he should be just doing this. Okay. This sounds good. Then you're working here. Oh, this is hard work. Um, and then once this guy is so... Now I have to wait until this guy finishes seeding here. And then this guy is supposed to seed here. So I should buy another seeder, probably. So let's drive to the shop. And let's buy another seeder there. That's probably a smart move. So we're going to leave the trailer here. Because then I can just... It appears as such that seeding is the bottleneck. I am not 100% sure though. Um, so I left this here. And let's go to the shop again. And see if we can buy a cedar. This appears to me that it is the fastest way. Look at this nice animation. It's so nice. At least the shop is, is close. And that's pretty good. Welcome. Let's see. Open the shop. And we want... We want cedars. How do I find this? Cedars. Okay, this small one is fine. And I would like to lease it, I think, just for this one day. Oh, there's... Ooh, ooh there's a lot. I just... Okay. How can I... 
do this. So I want to lease it. It costs per workday um, a lot. Why is it base cost per hour per day? It seems expensive. So for how long can I then keep it if I lease it? I mean... Can I even... No, this, this looks uh, fancy. Give me just the... Uh, give me the cheapest. Give me the one that I already have. But apparently I have this. Is this really the machine I have? Well, okay. Let's just lease it and let's figure it out. Okay, so I can now pick it up from the shop. Okay, and then I have no idea how long I can keep it. Be just one day? I don't know. And this is already 2,000. If one field only gives me 8,000, this already takes all of the profits. Hmm. Okay, so it's attached. What's a rich marker? Oh, it does something. Okay. So we drive back to our farm. And then, well... We see if we can have two trucks on one field, because one is plowing, and then this guy could just uh, sow some additional canola. I hope that the canola harvesting works. I don't need specialized equipment, but we will see. So this guy is seeding here. So now I want this guy to seed here. Okay, so I want to unfold, I want to um, lower, and ah, it's empty. So how do I fill it? That's the question. Well, I think we can, isn't there a way to buy stuff here? Vehicle overview. Can I not go to like the shop here? Or do I now have to drive back and... Okay. Then let's drive back to the shop. With this car. And see if we can buy some seeds. For canola I think. Right to the left. It's complicated but... Like it's not an easy game actually to start, but uh, I think at some point I will manage. Okay, so how do I get this now? Objects. I want... Um, yes, seeds I want. Of... Which one are these? I want... Um, grain, yeah? Okay, uh, well, let's just buy it. Yes. Okay. Back. Back, back. Can I put them in my truck? I hope so. Please tell me I can put them in my truck. But I don't have a forklift. How can I? This is getting complicated. Just by hand. I hope this works. Hand tool. Hand tool. Switch to hand tool. Activate hand tool. Give me my... I want to... Object is too heavy. What do you want me to do about this now? I... How can I do this? Okay, let's just... Uh, read away. Let's figure it out. 
Okay, apparently I have to drive next to this with the cedar. So, back we go, lift it, and we're going back with the cedar. Well, this could have been easier, but not much we can do about it. So I read online that you have to drive next to it, apparently. It's interesting because all these game mechanics are not self-explanatory, but oh well, this is what we have to do as a farmer out here. Many unnecessary trips, but uh, at least a good uh, learning curve. Refill. Yes. So am I re refilling all the crops? Yes. Nice. Okay. Can I now just give this guy a job to do the field over there? Let's see if this somehow works. So I want to get this guy. I want to create a job. I want him to do field work on this field. target position and then how can I set go start let's follow this guy and see if he actually does what um, he is supposed to do so I mean he will drive very well, so we will be there before him. I have no idea what to do with his pellets now, but... Oh well, that's a future problem. Like, it's annoying. Why would this shop have machinery to put it up in my pickup truck? So this guy is now arriving. And... He should start to seed the field. Should be... Ah, there he comes. And his job should be to start up to start start seeding this field here. Let's see how far the this other guy is pretty far. This he's almost done. And then all the fields are planted and we will just sleep until we can harvest, I think. And then we, we made our first first year of harvest. Let's look at this guy, if he does the right job. Good day, sir. I hope you do good work, otherwise I have the good trusty steel. I promise you, you don't want this. Oh, it's even, is it a woman? Still the same. Why is there stones in my field? Are you dropping stones? Come here, if I get you. I will get you. Okay, so... This guy seems to be doing work. This is almost done. This is being... Okay, so we can do multiple steps directly behind each other. That's pretty good. So... Now we wait until... This is sown. And then... Um, we go sleep and wait for the harvest I think but that's something for a future video and I will see you then thanks for watching so now we just wait until they are done with this uh, work and we'll come back once they are So, this, this field is now finished sawing, seeding, probably it's seeding, and um, this guy's just making the last draw, and the important thing is that I unload uh, my cargo that I have, and I'll put it here somewhere, okay. And then 
I need to, because this is the rented equipment, I need to return it. Um, I think it can be done. Uh, let's check. Uh, I think it can be done here somewhere. Um, yes, so these are my tools, least items. That's this one. Um, this is supposed to be returned. Okay, so this is gone. Then I can check back on this truck. This guy is also being done. And now um, we have done everything. And we will now sleep for a year until this is finished. And we'll just track updates eventually. So let's drive back to our house and let's go sleeping until we can harvest. I'm not sure if this is how you're supposed to play the game, but uh, let's say this is the only way I know how to. So let's sleep until uh, nine. Sleep. And we wake up in autumn, I guess. I think one night is one month. So we need to do this 10 times or something until we can harvest. We will lose 200 every day for the property. But um, if we look in the calendar, yes, we are now in October and we need to wait until July so we can harvest again. So this is all growing. I'm just checking out my fields. They look quite good. So, let's go back to sleep. October. Oh, now everything is colorful. The balloon is still in the sky. I wonder if it will be always in the sky. This is a great life as a farmer, just sleeping all the time. I wonder if this turns out profitable with three fields because we have running costs and then there will be one day where I have to like harvest all this stuff again. So we'll see. Property fees increased. That's interesting because it's like inflation or something. Um, okay, these are my fields. So yeah, still look, looks autumn. I will sleep two more times and I will show you again in January. So this is how it looks in January and actually the property maintenance is increasing. Um, I think around one dollar per day so it looks like there is something like inflation. This is the crops we have. Um, this looks like, um, well, that we don't want it but I have no idea how to remove it. So we'll just see each other again in... Uh, July once it's finished growing so let's just sleep until then okay we have July now it's sunny again and our crops they look all decent let's check them out so this is growth growing and um, I think I can check if they're finished here so this bit is ready to harvest and these others still uh, need some time. So I'm actually going to sleep one more day. So uh, everything is is completed and then we can go and harvest. So now it is actually August. So one year later, we just step for one year. And now all of these fields should be ready to harvest. They are. This looks great. And now we use our machine. And um, we harvest. And I will probably even rent another machine to harvest again. Interestingly enough, one year before we had more money. So we actually lost money with uh, what we are doing right now. So we will unfold the harvester. 
Let's go here to the right place. Let's lower it. How to lower it with V. We're going to draw a hatch. I'm not sure what this does. Let's leave it open for now, turn it on and see what happens. So my canola increases and the straw is being put everywhere. Do we want this? Let's probably not do that. So now the straw is getting put everywhere. But we cannot do anything with it anyway. So let's just hire the AI worker and he will do what he has to do. So now let's see if we can lease another one of the harvesting machines. harvesters just so we can harvest these fields a bit quicker so uh, let's check how much this is so if we get another one of these do they have a different they're like pretty much the same oh but they also need like the harvesting front part so this would cost um, 3,000 to lease. And then in addition, I think I would need uh, another like header, like this one. And this would cost 1,000. So we are here for another 4,000, uh, but we have many, many fields, so Let's lease it and see if it will turn out to be profitable. So with this we can basically just get even more workers. And it can be done with white and standard wheels. I don't think what the white um, wheels give us, but oh well. For some reason this just was way more expensive than what I thought, but okay. So we hook up this front part. Let's see. Let's just hook it, attach, yes. And then we are going to give it an AI mission. It should uh, we're creating a job, it should do field work and it should start here and go in this direction and then let's go. I'm not sure what my other machine is doing. Like this guy is now driving, but what are you doing? You should have an AI worker doing the work. Have fun. Please do the work. I hope that this guy now does it well. And in the meantime, one thing we can do is hook up our trailer again. Because we will need to empty the harvester as well once it's full. So let's hook the, up this trailer. Come on. We have it attached. And let's drive to the fields. Let's go. And with the other harvester I'm trying, I'll probably try again the other harvesting method not uh, this one where it just spreads out everything but where it will be gathered let's see what this is doing this guy is doing it and she will just 
drive over the fields. This is not so nice because you destroy my crops, but if you think this is the best way to do it, bro. Kind of mean. He did something weird and just started here in the middle. <laughs> this is how the AI workers do it. Okay. Seems really weird to me. But um, uh, it might be because uh, he can't turn around. Okay. Okay, I got it. And you should now. Okay, he doesn't start automatically. So we want to lower the header. And we want to turn on the harvester. And we want to hire an AI worker. No field found. Yeah, bro. I can show you the field. And we want to... Ah, straw is not available for this type, so... There's nothing. Wait. Yeah, okay, never mind. We just let the AI worker do it. And we will check the. Uh, another different camera. the time lapse. With that, uh, this first field is almost finished. And then we just have this field on the side here left. The biggest one. And we're going to empty this truck in the silo. Not going to sell it yet. And probably going to sell the other one just for the speed of it. Okay, so we fold the harvester. Now ah, we can't because it's filled. Okay. So let's drive back to the silos, empty it, and. Um, then do this other field over here. And the other harvester over there is doing well. <laughs> and we now 10k less than <laughs> what we originally had, which is quite funny, because so far we just made minus. Uh, let's see if after we sell all the stuff, if it increases. I do hope so, otherwise it's quite an unprofitable venture. So, let's drive in here. This is a tight fit. We can already put the pipe out. Like this. And it's putting all the canola in there. So, we're getting a lot of canola. I think there were some price charts somewhere. Um, maybe it makes sense to do this. So we're currently in August. So if we wait until November, we will actually get way more. Money for the stuff that we harvest. So that's good. Now I'm going to Put this guy on this field, uh, lengthwise, so let's go here and actually let's enjoy the thing and actually harvest the first bit ourselves. I mean we cannot let the AI do everything, some things we need to do on our own. Let's see how this goes.
This is now all just us driving by hand without the AI. Okay, looking good. Uh, but now we actually hire a worker again because we need to empty the other truck. And let's see if we can do it while driving next to it. And then we will actually also put it in the silo to sell it at the highest possible price. And we will have to wait until it turns because otherwise I will have to drive through the fields. So I wonder why the other truck, like the other AI is like blinking, but I don't know. I have no idea. So let's wait until this thing turns around and then we are going to drive next to it. Funny how they turn around like in the field. Somehow this kind of doesn't make sense, but oh well. Let's go here. And let's hope. Yes, it's doing its thing. Oh, yes. Ah, we need to go faster. Go faster. Come on. Okay, this is doing it. Come on, unload. Yes. Yes, let's go. This is not incredibly easy, but um, it's for sure a lot of fun. Ah, okay, and then at the end it, it waits for me. So let's fill up our thing. Okay, we are full. And it should retract it. I think it does. Yeah, let's put it in a silo. Very nice. This is how we work around here. Very efficient. Put it here. Start overloading. How can I fill it back in? That's my question. Uh, probably a full trailer I can only... ...empty. And then I need to, like once it's empty, I can probably fill it again. Let's see. I wonder if like always hiring these AI workers, you actually make money, but I guess we will find out soon. Okay, so now it's empty. So if we drive here, we should be able to fill it as well. How can we fill it? I want to put stuff in here. Please give me stuff. How can I... Okay, start filling with R. I want... Canola. Start. Will it overflow? No, it just stops once it's full. That's great. So now we close the cover. And we can actually already drive it to the sales point and just keep it there until, well, until the work, like until we sell it. So we will just stay there for months, but also Okay, this worker claims he has finished the work. So let's do the last piece over here. You can finish this as well. So we have two AI workers on this field. And ah, we actually cannot drive it to the shop because... Nope, we can empty the... I was wondering because we have to empty the, the harvesters. But actually we don't have to because... Uh, we can empty them in this other place as well. This is the grain mill. This is the marisot. And this is 
at uh, Leipzig. Uh, there were like different prices at different locations. Um, like I should wait until the month and then sell it at the highest paying one. So actually I will uh, stay parked here and then once time is due I will sell it at this other place. So we will we'll wait for that again and then this will be the last thing we do to see if we break even or if we make a profit. Okay, so let's leave the, this rest bit for the last worker to do. Let's empty this machine. And um, then this is the least one, so we will return it again anyways. The graphics looks kind of weird here. Um, I will actually probably check the settings if I can improve this, because my compute shouldn't be too bad, at least for this quality. I don't see why this would be calculation intensive like this game. So let's empty this machine. Another, what's this? 4,000 liters? Or is it 400? 4,000, I think. Good harvest. Okay, all getting in here. And once it's empty, we're going to sell it back. Like, end the lease. And the machine back there is doing its last run. So let's end the lease by, well, probably hopping out of the vehicle. And then going to our machinery, where we have our leases somewhere here. So let's return it. Yes. Yes. And this is also to be returned. Yes. Yes, so these are gone, that's nice. And we can actually at the same time, we can start plowing this field. Um, so we lower the cultivator. Wait, get in here. Go forward and start plowing here. So we hired a worker. Lower cultivator and higher. Why can you not do it? Lower. There is a field here. Don't complain about it. Okay, now he's doing it. So, now we just wait for this machine to do the last run. And then we go sleep and then we sell and then we see if we actually made profit. So, from all this work we need to make at least 10k to to break even but I hope this this will work out okay we will deposit now this grain as well it's almost full and then we will sleep until November and then because the price is then the highest and then we will sell our grain and then we see if we made profits I sure do hope so so let's, we can already put this out and put it in the silo. And let's get it in there. Okay. We can already exit. This machine will exit just fine. It should be quite fast. And let's go ahead back and sleep until the time is right. Well, some crops are still left here for some reason, but um, it should make too much a difference. So let's check again. We will sleep until November because usually prices are then the highest. So it's July, we sleep two months. 